folks, welcome to another Boats and Bits. In this episode, I am going to show you how to make a cheap version of the Raymarine cable for connecting Talk instruments like these here together. Um, I had been buying these on eBay. I am second hand trying to pick them up cheap uh, for my wee sort of workbench here. I've been doing with uh, the Naughty Control stuff on my other channel. Um, but I found an easier way. I was obviously making some of the cables for my own boxes, so it made sense to figure out a way to actually connect these together. So what I've done is just using shielded cable, and um, I'll stick a link down below. Um, you can get quite cheap, a lot cheaper than the other. So basically, if you take it like this is three core. Well, and technically you can get away with two core because you you use the shield basically as the ground. So you get yellow, white, and red. The reason I liked the four core was because they had yellow and uh, earth, yellow and red, which is the same as sea talk really. Uh, the white's irrelevant, but you can go for the cheap ones. Like a link, you can get. They usually have the option of two and three. It's the same process. So all I'm doing here is using my wee things cable things to get that get the plastic off. And then what I do is basically the shield scroll up nice and well. And then what we'll do is the ones that we're interested in, we're interested in the earth, which we'll use this one, uh, the yellow, which is our data, and red is our 12 volt. Uh, so we'll go ahead and we're actually just going to put crimps on these here. Uh, so, so I'm just using my cable stripper, put them back. Say so there we go. So we can really do away with that. Um, so the other thing we have then is these wee mini crimps. So they're kind of half size crimp. Well, again, I'll stick a link down below, but they're half the width of the normal ones. Um, and we'll just go and these on. Okay, so okay, so and if we take a look now in the back, we the sea talk is actually so red, grey for earth, yellow for data. So that's one side done. I only need to be short length for what I'm doing here, so I'll cut off here. So I'll cut off another wee bit here. So just a wee short length. So if you kind of see there, we've just got the red, which goes to the red wire, and the ground going to the middle, and then the data going to the end. So we'll just repeat the process. Get off the cable stripper. Just connect it in here. Red. Yellow on the outside and earth in the middle. So now we have these two joined together and next up so now we have these two joined together next up i will stick it onto my data bus and you'll be able to see basically this in action okay so we're down here in the, the test bench uh, going to test the homemade raymarine connectors uh, what i'll do is i'll just plug into my bus and hopefully things don't go puff oh. 
boom. And there we go. Uh, and there we go. We have the speed, depth, try. That's all running from those wires I created there now. So it all seems to be working fine. All right, folks, thanks for watching. Um, hopefully you've seen how to quickly fire up some Raymarine Sea Talk cables uh, on the cheap, a lot cheaper than you buy them directly from Raymarine and for me to do the same job. Um, quick plug, <coughs> you've probably seen the other videos, uh, my Naughty Control ST Wireless V1. So it's basically a wee wireless controller uh, for the Sea Talk bus. So it allows you to communicate with your phone, uh, display, you know, displays wee gauges and stuff on your phone. It allows you to do remote control. We use one of these wee boils to actually change your autopilot and things like this here. It also relays uh, the Sea Talk to, over a uh, Wi Fi connection to Open Marine and, you know, Linux and Signal K and Open CPN and Navionics and things like that there. So you can actually get your data, such as depth, speed, wind direction, all the rest, onto your phone tablets and all the rest. Uh, so yeah, go and give the other channel a like. I'll stick a wee link down below um, and you can buy these boxes on those websites. All right, folks, thanks again. All right, see you all later. Cheers, bye.